Hey YouTube land, Coach John here at gf2revolution.com. It is my day two of the Ultimate Reset. Um, about 8.30 at night now. Um, I just got off work um, two hours in a row um, teaching uh, strength and conditioning classes and uh, all that kind of fun stuff, working with kids, watching them improve and get better, which is all about, so which is awesome. Um, I'm happy I'm in a good mood right now. Uh, I've been hungry today, I ain't gonna lie. Um, and you, like, you see me right now, I'm happy, I'm in a good mood. That wasn't the case <laughs> for the whole day. Debbie's over here in the back going like, that is the freaking truth. I was, I was like Grumpy Cat. You guys know Grumpy Cat? Alright, I love Grumpy Cat. Grumpy Cat's funny just this. Right? Uh, <laughs> uh, so we woke up, uh, breakfast today. I woke up, I felt kind of rested. I slept, I felt like I slept more through the night than I normally do. I have a Fitbit. If anyone knows what a Fitbit, let's show you what the Fitbit is. I got a lot of stuff here today. So, up! Oh, Fitbit, it's a little cal step counter, calorie counter, distance, uh, activity level, time, value. It's kind of a cool gadget. It really helped me learn a lot about myself. But anyways, so, woke up, felt pretty rested, um, had breakfast, which ended up being organic yogurt um, with blueberries. Um... Steel cut oatmeal with blueberries and walnuts, because I'm a guy. Because wal walnuts, I get to have more, so that was kind of cool. Um, I was not a fan of our organic yogurt, though. It, was, it wasn't so much on the goodness. Thin. But, what was that? It was thin. It was thin, yeah. It wasn't like, you know, yogurt's usually thicker. It was thin. I don't know. Um, and then I fell back asleep afterwards, because I was feeling tired again. Um, woke up, I was doing some work around 10 o'clock. And I was getting hungry again, hungry. I'm like, oh, I gotta wait for it. So I kept drinking my water, trying to do that. Just feeling tired and kind of spacey. Um, then I had lunch. Lunch was good. I liked lunch today. Um, I don't like the tomatoes, though. I'm really not a fan of the tomatoes. The cucumbers, I'm getting okay with. But the tomatoes, they're just bleh. I don't know. I got these little cherry tomatoes. I don't know. Um, so it was a Greek salad with uh, cucumbers. Pine nuts, tomatoes, and chicken. Uh, three ounces of chicken. So that was good. And was there anything else with it? No, that was it. No, you didn't have olives. I didn't have Oh, Debbie had olives. I hate olives. I ain't trying them. I don't care. Um, and then I got really tired again about an hour and a half later, right before I had to take my alkanize, which two ounces is much better. It's only two gulp gulps. So we're going to try a shot glass tomorrow. Okay, day three shot glass for Alkanize. Yeah. Oh! Then I got home, and I don't know what happened. Something didn't work right for me, and I got grumpy pissy, and I was in a bad mood for like an hour and a half. Debbie's like, why are you in a bad mood? I'm like, I don't know. Leave me alone. I was grumpy. Um, what would that last for, like two hours? Yeah. It was like, I don't know. So that was today. Then we started making dinner, and... I was spacey again, um, and it just one thing, when you read everything that goes into it, don't just go into day two, go, okay, we're having Southwestern tacos, oh, Southwest tacos, those are bomb diggity, snip, snap, sweet, let me tell you, greatest meal of the entire thing, I don't care what anyone says, great. Um, so, go in and look at all the steps that it takes to plan out, and if you're cooking brown rice you didn't realize when you got this good brown rice it takes 50 minutes to cook so get that in your schedule so you know ahead of time what's going to happen what ingredients are needed because sometimes you go okay i need southwestern tacos go to page 98 and then oh i need brown rice and beans to go to page 75 and then it goes oh go back over here to 76 and there's there's so many little steps it takes a little getting used to to know exactly where everything is at and then i had to rush out the door i went to work and now I'm back home. Um, I'm a little hyped up, I guess, because I've been moving. Um, I got a little left water. And I don't know. I think that's a recap for today. I don't know. I, that's all I got. So, oh, I lied. That's not all I got. I forgot to tell you guys. So, this is the Ultimate Reset pre-post test that um, Debbie over here was so graciously... To make so you can go get it at our website gf2revolution.com and type in ultimate reset pre post test and you get this guy it's in the book but you know it's nice to print it out so you don't have to write in your book 
And now we got this from our day one the other day. So that's the other thing I want to tell you guys. Other than that, have a great night. And I will see you tomorrow for day three. Bye.